Let's get going. Fit check. All night. All night. All night. All night. All night. Hello, stranger. It's been a minute since we last kicked it. By the way, just got in town. And I won't let cumulus clouds all in the sky ruin my vibe. Usually I don't do this oh. Option Due to unusual Rain and thunder Baby, I wonder Baby, I wonder What's up? What's up, queens? Yo I'm so I'm I'm not even I'm exhausted. So let me tell you all about my day, right? I got up at what was that four? Well, I woke up at that time My alarm was supposed to go off at five But I woke up at four and I kept trying to go back to sleep because I'm like I have another hour to sleep But I couldn't like I would sleep and I just kept on waking up. I look crusty. I need some lip gloss at least Also, let me also smell nice for you guys. I need some lip gloss nigga The F I'm gonna do with some chapstick and because last night i was exhausted after okay let me say the past 48 hours i've mainly been on my feet i have been up and down running errands doing shopping not only for myself for other people but then i also had i also have schoolwork but i'm so close to the finish line so 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 close and then um yeah so last night the moment that i got back from the mall around five i was running up and down packing trying to sort things out and everything i finally went to sleep at 12 30 and then um yeah i woke up at four like i mentioned and then i got up i started i continued packing because i was so tired i hadn't finished packing i had to finish cleaning my room i was actually sweating in the morning then there's also the struggle of taking things down the stairs i thought it was going to be a smooth ride because i had left for the airport in good time i got there this place is empty, like the check-in desk is not even open. So I'm like, if we're leaving, or we're supposed to be leaving in uh, just under two hours, shouldn't the um, shouldn't at least the check-in desk be open or, you know? We had to wait just to find out that our flight had been delayed an hour. I was already tired, I was hungry, I didn't eat much this morning. Checking in was also a struggle because my luggage is always overweight. This time it was hectic so yeah i had to move things from the smaller bag to the bigger bag because she was like okay rather you pay overweight for one bag than you pay overweight for both so make this one more overweight than this one i paid so much money <laughs> i paid like 800 rand you all saw this i don't know if you saw this in the vlog that i just did i hold um in the hall it's so so cute and it was on sale but i dropped it at the airport and it's supposed to be like this like this is supposed to connect but i dropped it at the airport and it just broke like just broke so i was like okay you know what i can fix it when i sit down i tried to sit down i made it worse i just broke another piece off so i'm like you know what i'm gonna just take the whole thing off i am so hungry but for some reason i have no appetite but i know that i need to eat first thing that i need to do is drink water I'm always scared to drink water in hotel rooms because I'm just like, won't they charge me 2,000 rand extra or something? Guys, one of the main reasons why I booked this hotel was because I, the, I was here in February and yeah, the rooms are not amazing, but the outside is so, so nice. Guess what, girl? There's construction work going on, so the pool area is closed. So I can't even go chill there. I was just going to get some... I was going to get a drink and go chill by the pool. And who's going to do that with all those construction workers there? My best bet is to just change and 
get some food, order some food on Uber Eats. I'm so sure that Joburg Uber Eats is much better than PE. PE is just the same thing. Steers, Debonairs, that I, I hate Debonairs. KFC, Wimpy, Nando's. I've been thinking about Popeye's chicken. I don't know if they still have Popeye's chickens in Joburg. I was gonna go to Eastgate Mall. After that, how much I had to pay for excess in PE, I already know that tomorrow I'm, ha I'm gonna have to pay again. I won't pay as much tomorrow because then um, I don't have to pay for the extra bag. And then I'm also gonna move some stuff, gonna shift some stuff so that I can just like, you know, fix that up. But yo, I'm so tired. I'm not going to flipping Eastgate. That was gonna be a whole different vlog on its own. Not a different vlog, but that was gonna be such a fun part of this vlog. But there's nothing fun about going to the mall alone. I mean, I do it all the time, but it's also the fact that I don't even know my way around Eastgate, like the way that I know my way around malls in PE. I wanted to go to Zara. I wanted to go perfume shopping in Zara. I need something to drink. I need a good, strong, drink but the first thing that i need to do is order alcohol what am i saying the first thing that i need to do is order food mcdonald's oh hell no i'm considering ordering chicken licken but last time i've no not even last time every time i have chicken licken i get sick i don't want to risk it <laughs> i don't want to risk it why don't they have anything exciting they have chicken licken kfc mcdonald's roman's pizza come on now come on I'm not ordering steers. I've been eating steers all month. One hour later. So, I just decided to go for something that I'm used to. Mmm, yummy. Where's my bacon? Okay. So I got a cheese and bacon burger from steers. It looks so good, but I didn't get a drink. Why didn't I get a drink? But after this weekend, I'm not eating. I'm not eating fast food anymore. I'm gonna work out and stuff. I think it's for the best. But this weekend, girl, I'm gonna stuff my face. Okay. Look at myself in this mirror, and I'm wondering, why do we dance when we eat? Why do we do that? you guys the fact that i had plans but i had plans for the afternoon i was gonna go sit chill i even changed my dress i changed my outfit i wore a cute dress i was gonna go sit chill by the bar and then i was just like oh let me just get some shut eye you know just a few winks i slept for a good two hours anyway i needed it i was exhausted I feel much better now. I feel much better than I did when I just landed. So yeah, now I want to go sit by the bar. I also just realized that I didn't... Let me turn on all the lights. I also just realized that I didn't give you guys a room tour. And what's a hotel stay as a YouTuber without a room tour? I don't know who here is watching me today that used to watch me last year and the year before. December or November, so I guess now November. I would come to a hotel, obviously I, I have to because when I'm traveling home, I have to spend the night in Joburg. So I would just book a pretty room in a hotel and then just, you know, vlog. In 2019, I did a clothing haul um, and I actually shot a pamper routine, but then I didn't finish filming it and then I ended up not even putting it up. And then in 2020, I, did an, I shot another clothing haul in the aviator hotel in kempton park as well that hall was nice i actually really enjoyed filming that but then that hall like just me sitting in the room and then i after that i also filmed a pamper routine me sitting in the room really made me miss out on actually just enjoying the hotel that i'm at you know of course i did mention before that there's construction but then um you know, might as well just go sit by the bar, right? Yeah, so 2021, I'm not filming any routines or hauls or whatever. I just want to relax. Hello. Hey, girl. The room is kind of a mess right now because when I got here, I kind of just put things, like, I kind of just dumped things on the bed. And my suitcase is open now and my shoes are just out. Everything just looks really bad. Let me do a quick room tour. Turn on all the lights for this. Like I said, I'm sorry that the room is a mess, 
but yeah when you walk in this is the first thing that you see i have a toilet here to the left and yeah it's just just a toilet i was actually wondering is this a fan or is it because of the style of the hotel with the airport hangar or hangar, I don't know what it's called, thingy, plane hangar or hangar thingy. So I'm not really sure, but I don't think that's a fan. <laughs> Maybe it's just a decoration. But yeah, and then um, I never know how to use these things. I won't even like. And then over here I have the shower and a little sink. I love, 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 love sinks like this because it just feels like a bowl and you don't make a mess when you are washing your face or brushing your teeth or whatever i love things like this what's this um some little products that i will definitely be using tomorrow because that's just me um i also do want to open my suitcase to start rummaging through my shower stuff so yeah i'll definitely be using that but this does not look like it will be enough for my body <laughs> There's this mirror. I love the style of this mirror. I think they really, really have like nailed the whole um, theme of the hotel that they have gone with. And this shower is so, so, so pretty. So pretty. And you get like a, a curtain here. So it's like a partition. So you don't have to see the shower. You can shower and not have to. I don't know. The last time that I was at this hotel, I was just not into it. I was not into it. I literally just stayed in my room. I ate. I did absolutely nothing. So yeah, today I'm definitely going to do something. I'm going to enjoy the shower. And then I get to look at myself as I shower. So I thought that was pretty cool. I also love, love, love the shower caddy. There's something about shower caddies like this. I think they remind me of like the shower talk videos that I watch on TikTok. And then you will see something like this. You'll see like tons of them on the wall and that's what people do and then when you step out here you have a mirror and i told you guys that i changed because i really thought that i was i in fact i i even considered going to eastgate i really thought that i was gonna go but then there were just so many things that told me not to go so yeah here you have the bed um i've already slept in it and still continuing with the plane theme situation i think this is like a re i think this is a really pretty piece of art if this hotel definitely reminds me of the aviator hotel because that one is also kind of like that one is also kind of basically plane airplane um themed i thought this was a really nice lamp even if you don't want to have it on it's just nice to look at it just looks really nice and then this side table also looks like something that i would love to have in my home maybe if it was gold but i do like the silver i think yeah silver would be better i don't know i've been like having a, a thing between silver and gold so i'm not sure yeah and then i have a tv that i will not be using or maybe i will who knows and then a little coffee slash tea station that basically every hotel has you have a safe and a little like some storage if you want to put your clothes and stuff and then um yeah this is where i'm staying the protea hotel by marriott i will definitely be coming to drink some coffee tonight and tomorrow morning before i leave the breakfast here is amazing i had it earlier on this year it's amazing and ignore that that's my stuff this is my stuff as well let me i might as well just put that in here now because i'm not gonna wear that yeah then over here i have like this is where i was sitting again please excuse for the, excuse the mess i was exhausted a little desk area and then a little mirror yeah guys that's the room there's also a little more closet space here where you can hang up things so guys i'm gonna put on some shoes and i'm gonna head down to the bar let's let's do that it's not that i don't want you here it's something about the way you stay Hello. Hello. No. 
The drink menu is quite lame, but I got a nice bottle. This stuff is so good. I promise you, anything that you try to buy at a hotel is just gonna be so expensive as compared to trying to get it in the liquor store. got back to the room i just you know i was on the phone with my boo and that's it i'm actually running late it's seven and i was supposed to be done like i was supposed to be out of this room going to have breakfast much earlier than this this is the outfit of the day really simple and i was also filming a few tiktoks so yeah that's what took long this morning but yeah i'm about to go downstairs have some breakfast i really wish i could have done my edges but my only edge brush i don't know where i left it i'll see what i can do when i get back but i have to go eat now i have to go have breakfast i got these really cute hoops from mr price the earrings like the studs i think are also from mr price i can't remember but i got these really cute hoops from mr price i'm obsessed and they're so light i don't really wear big hoops because um, of how heavy they get but these ones are so so light so yeah i really love that actually my whole fit is from the fix top is from the fix skirt i bought months ago but also from the fix i can't remember where i got this scarf shoes shoe city something yeah so i'm about to head out let me get my bag all right i don't need to take my bag i just need i just i'm just taking that little purse so let's go guys Okay, ladies and gents, so I'm about to head out. All this lip gloss just to put on my mask. I did my edges by the way, or at least I attempted to. I know that. Please. It's 8 22. My flight is at 12 20. So I'm gonna go to the airport now, but then I have to wait for the shuttle, the 845 shuttle. So yeah, I'm gonna wait for that. Let me go check out. I'm really, really excited to be finally leaving. I would have loved to stay here for another night because I don't know if I can say I really, really enjoyed my time here because I was so tired and I didn't really take the time to you know, sit by the bar, chill, have fun. When I sat by the bar, it was just for a couple of hours. I was alone anyway. Maybe if I had made plans with somebody. Yeah, I was alone anyway. And yeah, it's just... I even ended up only having two glasses. This much in the glass even. And I just like came and I packed the bottle. My nephew just turned six months. He's the cutest human being in the world. What's this one? This one's CK. I have a mini for the glam goddess also heavenly in my bag so yeah that's what i can use to touch up but then I, yeah I just prefer... sorry i didn't rub i just yeah i just prefer to have that on hand hi right, guys all right guys i don't know if i'm gonna vlog now but i'll probably see you next at the airport Alright, so that was hectic. I didn't vlog anything um, from the time that I left the hotel up until now that I'm sitting. And I'm not even at the gate. I was so tired and my back hurts 
so much. I'm not even actually sitting at my gate. I'm sitting at gate A7 to A8, but my gate is A11. Boarding starts in 30 minutes. So I could just sit here. There's a little cute shop, coffee shop right next to me that also serves alcohol. I'm considering buying a drink. So you see how I'm wearing this um, head wrap, right? So when I was going through the, like, what, what is it where you take out your laptop and your phone and you do the, the metal scanner? I don't know. As I'm looking through the thing, the guy is like, no, you have to take off your jacket. I just looked at him and I'm like, you literally watched me from the time that you helped me put my things on here, walk through. You're trying to tell me to walk back, you know, and then he was just like, it's okay. I just looked at him. I didn't say anything. And then he was just like, it's okay. And then um, he was like, somebody needs to come and search your duke. So I was like, okay. Because, um... <laughs> I don't give a shit. Protect you, protect us. Yeah, so I'm like, okay, that's crazy. I've traveled in a head wrap a few times. Nobody's ever searched my head wrap. So the guy, so the, he's like, okay, we need a woman to come and search this for you. So please just wait here. A woman comes and then she like starts searching my thing. And then the man is like, um, if you don't mind, can you please take it off so she can search properly? No, what, are you crazy? I'm like, are you crazy? Of course I mind. Why else would I have it on if I wanted my hair out? Why else would I have it on? The back of my hair is braids. The middle of my hair is just the little, my hair is in like little uh, elastic bands. And then the front of my hair is just my afro. Why would I have a head wrap on if I was comfortable with taking it off in the airport? Yo, I was annoyed. You don't even understand. Anyway, um, let me put my stuff down and then I'm gonna go have a drink. It's not that I don't 